Let's make a functional tank track. First, add a curve circle, rotate it 90 degrees on the Y axis, and scale it into a tank track shape. Now add a cube for a track link and shape it however you like. Add an array modifier, adjust the offset to match the link orientation, then add a curve modifier, select the curve as the object, and set the correct deform axis. Increase the array count until the links fully cover the curve. If you get gaps, adjust the array offset or scale the curve. When we move the curve, the track moves properly, but instead of moving the curve, let's use an empty for control. Select both the curve and the empty, press Ctrl plus P, and parent them. Now we can move the track with the empty. The issue is when we move the empty along X or Z, the track deforms incorrectly. To fix it, add a child of constraint to the track, disable the Y axis in the location section, and set the curve as the target. Next, when we rotate on the Z axis, the track detaches from the curve. To fix that, add a pivot constraint, choose the curve as the target, and set the rotation range to Z. It works for positive Z, but not for negative Z. So duplicate the pivot constraint and set the rotation range to negative Z. Now the tank track works smoothly in every direction. 